This is an ABC 10 News update. And good evening. I'm Steve Atkinson in the ABC 10 News studio. The city of San Diego is facing a lawsuit over its vaccine mandate. That lawsuit was filed by Perk. That's a nonprofit who says that they are doing it on behalf of first responders and city workers. This is the sixth lawsuit the organization has filed in regards to COVID vaccinations. They believe the city does not have the authority to place this mandate. They also believe the mandate is unconstitutional. Arson is now suspected to be the cause of a fire that broke out at the home of County Supervisor Nathan Fletcher and his wife, former assembly member Lorena Gonzalez Fletcher. Crews say that fire started in an outdoor trash can engulfing the front of the home in flames. This was around four o'clock in the morning on January 12th. The family was awakened by smoke alarms and they were able to escape safely through a back door. Anyone with information is asked to call police. Tonight, the Metro Arson Strike Team is investigating three fires that broke out in Balboa Park overnight. This is video of one of those fires. This was behind the municipal gym. According to San Diego Fire and Rescue, two others were lit in the wooded area west of the Oregon Pavilion. No injuries were reported. No buildings were damaged. Crews say that a, a few palm trees and a wooden stairwell, they were damaged, though, by the fires. Let's check in with our meteorologist Angelica Campos for your weekend forecast. Hi, Steve. The winds are set to continue, so that elevated fire danger is going to be a concern as we head into Saturday. Our wind advisory extends from the valleys all the way back to the mountains until 10 a.m. After 10 a.m., we'll start to see an improvement with onshore winds and cool down. I'll break it all down in your forecast coming up.